action. Hey, it's Lapsul from SFS Mag One Magazine, and I'm here with Wicked. What's up, man? How What's you doing? I'm, I'm good, brother. I'm good. It's a pleasure. Hey, look at this stylish. This idea. <laughs> like I said before, it's the laundry day. <laughs> what's up? I got your Abercrombie on. Yeah, yeah. Your Nikes. That's yeah, what's up. Yeah, I got comfortable. Some type of mountain boots from uh, Walmart. You know, fashion. <laughs> like you say, fashion is everything, right? It is every, every, whatever it is, you know, everything, everywhere. It's a, it's, a, it's a millennial era now, you know, so. And the 90s is coming back, so that's that's. That's, I'm a 90s baby, you know? We gotta yeah. bring back the fashion. We gotta bring back those sounds and everything. Yeah, yeah, well, I wanna ask you some questions about your artistry, first and foremost. Sure. I know you are a stylist, but you're also a musician. So yes, can uh, you tell me a little bit about what your sound is and how you identify it? Um, I'm, I'm more like in the hip hop phase of it, um, but I'm, I'm a, like a serious R&B fanatic, okay. you know, so R&B, um, jazz, that's, that's more my thing, like uh, blues too, you know, blues is like what you raised up off of coming up in the house, you know, when moms put that temptation on that Bobby mm -hmm. Blue playing, you know, mm -hmm. that Miles Davis, Miles Davis was playing in the house a lot, you know, okay. so a lot of Jackson 5, mm -hmm. probably everything Motown. Mm -hmm. Everything Motown. So. so good classic taste. Oh yeah. When oh, yeah. you listen to I'm more I'm more like trying to like really keen into a lot of the new artists with the with the wave of like how music is now on the internet, you mm -hmm. know, it's like if they playing it on the radio, you pretty much they, they pretty much like program you to listen to what's hot. Mm -hmm. You know, when they playing it on the radio. Mm -hmm. But I kinda like digging in and listen to a lot of independent artists. Cause there's a lot really? of good music out there that's not even really getting broke yet. You know, and so where do you find this new music? I'm a I'm a big title subscriber. Okay. You know, so I'm right. digging you gotta in. support your artists. You yeah, know? I'm I'm a big title subscriber and YouTube. Actually yes. everybody is the independent lane is real big now. So YouTube you'll just you'll find some of everything, mm -hmm. you know. So and, and where can we find your music? My music right now is all over that piff. I got like seven mixtapes out on there. Okay. I ain't been, I ain't been out. I ain't, I ain't dropped nothing as of recent. You know, I'm working on a new project right now, but um, it's gonna be like a small EP. But I'm really, I'm really like pushing my son right now. Lil Wicked, he got like a hip hop. Oh snap! So we're running the family now. Yeah, yeah, I'm pushing him right now. He, he actually got a, a studio session coming up. Uh, when he go, he practically grew up in the studio from mm -hmm. when we was doing our music thing. But um, like now he doing his own thing. He goes in the studio right now and knocks out like 10 songs at a time, you know, like a four, These five young hours. cats, it's yeah. like they do it in half the time. Yeah, yeah, he's, he's writing, he's doing his own thing. I produce myself, you know, but he's working with other producers, so that's dope. And the quality is there? Yeah, yeah. To your definitely. standard? Yeah, yeah, most definitely. <laughs> I'm, I'm almost definitely in some of the studio sessions, like, but I give him his creative control. I love him do his thing. That's really good. I love him do his thing. I'm more like I'm just making sure the business is all. Are you awesome. gonna end up on a project with him? You, if, you know, if if, if he's good enough, no. I'm just... Oh. <laughs> no. No, you know that what? Proud. That's 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 all him. If he want me to, I I love to do it with him. You know, but that's 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 all his move right there. Does he want to get on the track with you? You know what? He's been on music with me in the past. You know, okay. he's on like one of the albums in the past when he was a shorty. But now he's now that he's grown and he's into his own artistry. I mean, if he want to do 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 a record together, I'm most definitely open to it. I think I think the public will love it. Mm -hmm. You know, because. They they follow me. They follow my brand. They know I've been doing it for a while. So and is this your first time working with another artist? Even though it's your own blood, of course you have a familial type. But have you ever worked with a friend, build them up? Have you ever worked with some of the other local youth, building them up? Um, I have in the past. You know, um, I actually came um, from a group. You know, the name of the group was the Looney Band, mm -hmm. um, and we all had we it was three of us, and we um. All the, all the projects that I got out on that path pretty much was um, all group projects with my brother and my cousin. So and we work with other artists, um, like uh, work with other producers. Uh, Matt Hennessy has been even been featured on a couple of mixtapes that's out here. Um, shout out to my brother DJ Sluggo. Mm, yes, DJ yeah, Sluggo yeah. is a Chicago favorite. Yeah, shout out to Chicago out. Music Awards. Isn't yeah, it? yeah, that's 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 the big homie man. Over twenty years, you know, uh, practically grew up, you know, up through the projects with it. For real. So, like he's from Robert Taylor's. I'm from Ivy Wells, you know. So mm -hmm. he used to actually. 
uh, make house tracks for our dance group phase two. Okay, yeah, you so know, you so. touch dance music too? Oh yeah, uh, that's really the foundation. That's what the name Wicked came from. I'm mm -hmm. like, I would consider myself one of the pioneers of this whole little footwork culture before for like real. before it took off and became like mainstream. We was mm -hmm. we was the kids doing it in the projects and at the park districts. And have you heard of Tracks Records? Yeah, that's that's my record label. I just signed the tracks records. Oh yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah man. Well, man, I, I need to talk deal. about house music. Yeah, being yeah. a pioneer, that's all right there. Most definitely, DJ Dion, DJ Sluggo, all them doing my good brothers, DJ PJ, DJ Clint, mm -hmm. our people, all them get gone. Actually, those I just met DJ PJ. And uh, I performed at a club, and now he's spinning my tracks. <laughs> that's dope. That's dope. That's dope. There's a lot of support in the Chicago. Yeah, club, yeah Sluggo, he, he got a, a mixtape. He brought out, he started a mixtape series called Respect My Grind. Mm -hmm. And um, we actually premiered a song on the joint with him. And he actually, uh, we actually did a track with him called Bob Girl. It's an upbeat, like, house track. Oh. And you can actually download that on all music platforms that's on title spotify everything everywhere his music is streaming this song that's super yeah. dope well also check out wicked on that pit and you got a new project coming out you say yeah i'm working on the ep um i it's still in the makes still in the workings mm -hmm. you know so I'm, I'm looking like maybe second quarter 2020. okay Get those final dropping. tweaks make sure it sounds good yeah, yeah, do, yeah do you have any uh i would say final words for our audience that you want you know, for them to know who you are? Man, Wicked Cheech. Um, that's, that's the name on all platforms, you know, um, from acting to dancing to choreography to writing to producing. I'm all over the place. Yeah. Just follow me on Facebook, uh, Wicked Cheech, or Instagram, Twitter, all of this stuff. Thanks, I'm man. Appreciate you, Doc. We out. Appreciate.